I got it. Okay, well, this session we are going to talk about maybe food and food vocabulary. We're going to learn some yes. vocabulary related to food. Okay, now let me share my screen so that you can see the book and the board. Okay, well, now you can see it. Okay, I want to ask you a few questions oh. in order to teach you vocabulary related to food. Okay, tell me about the best aroma that you ever smelled. So it means that aroma is you smell of something strong and pleasant. For example, aroma of coffee. You know, that's really strong yeah. smell and, of course, pleasant. Okay, what is the yeah. best aroma that you have ever smelled? The best smell, right? Yeah. Aroma. Yeah. Yeah. Aroma. Mm, of food or other things? Uh, food. Yeah, it can be it can be something like coffee, something like sweet. Coffee. Ah. Yeah, everything. Ah, okay. You know, any smell. Uh, yeah. Or maybe a food. Some are some are some kind of cheese. I like uh, the smell of a uh, coffee and a uh, cheesecake. Cheesecake. Yeah, it's cheese. really good. Yeah. Good yeah. So you need to go to the friends. Uh, you know, they right. have thousands of, yeah, of course, they have a lot of, you know, plenty of, you know, different types of cheese. And that is really interesting yeah. to taste. I'm um, try them one by one, one by one. And yeah, it's good to yeah. go. But some, some kind, but some kinds does, does not a good smell, right? Of cheese. course, <laughs> of course, yeah. of course. You know, they have some, uh, you know, actually, as I told you, variety of, you know, types and cheese okay but of course it's not really pleasant to us you know maybe you know some, yeah. some of them have bad smells i don't know it's it's not good so of course you know yeah. but they say you know that is really interesting uh you know they believe that these of, of course for example with a really bad small cheese are really tasty yeah. i don't know yeah. maybe delicious and yeah. tasty <laughs> We don't know, of course. Yeah. Well, okay. Are you a food fan? Yes. Yeah, <laughs> I think so. Yeah. yeah. I, I love uh, eating. I love eating. Yeah, of course. And and what is the best, you know, meal for you? Breakfast or lunch or dinner? The most important one. The most important one. Yeah. Hmm. Maybe yes, Japanese food is uh is the best. No, uh, no, uh, you know, uh, I said he asked you about meals. For example, we have breakfast or lunch or dinner. So which meal can be the best and the most important meal? Oh uh, yes. Oh uh, for lunch and breakfast. Yeah, breakfast and lunch. For lunch and uh, breakfast, yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, tell me. Um, fine dining or a casual dining? Okay, what's the difference? Fine dining, really yeah. expensive, yeah. luxurious, good food, and yes. even luxurious yeah. restaurant. Casual dining, of course, normal, cheaper, and it's, it can be may, maybe more comfortable. So which one do you prefer? Oh, basically, I uh, use uh, Kaohsiung. Mm -hmm. Kaohsiung. Casual. Uh, yeah. Kaohsiung, yes. But yeah. uh, just in a special case, I, I mm -hmm. want to go to... Mm -hmm. uh, yeah, yeah, go to... Uh, yes, it's just a, a bit mm -hmm. expensive <laughs> restaurant. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I got it. Yeah. Okay, just, have you ever have you ever tried any exotic foods it means foreign food that maybe is a little unusual for you and you really liked it exotic food is foreign food that's maybe as a little unusual for you exotic exotic, exotic food it can be korean exotic chinese food. japanese yeah exotic Exotic food. 
excuse me. What oh, sorry. Okay, What's the so, meaning of plant? Yeah, exotic? Of course, oh, exotic, exotic food yeah. means foreign food, a foreign food from the other countries. That is that is unusual for you. Okay, so uh, you, yeah, of yeah. course. You're not familiar with this food, so this is exotic but, food. Foreign food oh, is yes. okay, a little understand. unusual. Yes, understand. Oh, for Japanese food, you know, uh, natto. Mm -hmm. Natto is uh, made from uh, bean. Beef. From bean. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but uh, it's a um, smell uh, not good. And uh, mm, how to say? Mm. Okay, how does it taste? <laughs> How does it taste? Oh, Sweet, sour, salty? Ah, uh, it's a bit uh, uh bitter. bitter. Bit yeah, oh god. Yeah, bitter? a bit, a bit bitter. <laughs> oh gosh. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. It seems uh, it's very good for health. Yeah. But uh, I don't like the smell. I don't like the uh, um Apparent, apparent. Yeah, I got the it. Vision, the vision yeah, is not yeah. good. It's yeah, yeah. It's look. Yeah. You not. don't like it's look. look. Yeah, I got look. it. It's look. Yeah, I got yes. it. Okay. Yeah. So, have you ever uh, taken someone whining and dining? This is an idiom. Whining, dining. For example, some companies uh, entertain their clients wine and dine or some companies wine and dine their client it means they for example uh i don't know uh, you know they entertain their clients or some people someone you know this is an example of course you can entertain someone to a good restaurant with food and wine okay and you pay Food, food and wine. Yeah. Food and wine. Um, this is whining and dining. Yeah. Of course, it can be used as verbs. So you can use in different tenses. For example, I whined and dined my friends. It means I entertained them to the restaurant. And of course, I bought food. I bought drink. Okay, wine. This is whining and dining. Okay, have you ever taken someone whining and dining? Oh, yes. Yes. Yes, sometime. Yeah, sometimes I say, I uh, have a chance to eat with my uh, client. Client. So uh, we uh, go to uh, some, yeah, some uh, restaurant and uh, yes, we drink, drink together. And uh, mm -hmm. I say, sometimes we also have uh, my, uh, mm -hmm. we, we have a party at my yeah. home. Oh, no, no, sorry, not, not my home, but uh, we have just in a special case. Yeah. We uh, go out and uh, yes, we, we yeah. drink. I got it. Yeah. And Together. okay, name a Vietnamese mouth watering food. Really delicious. A mouth watering food, it means, you know, really oh, delicious. Food. Yeah. Name. Ah, uh, mouth watering. What touring food? It's yeah. mean uh, very it's delicious. It's really delicious. Food. Yeah, it's really delicious. Oh, hmm, yeah. Okay, for for example, for for Japan, so no, for Vietnamese food, mm. example for is a uh, Vietnamese sandwich, Vietnamese yeah. sandwich, sandwich. Uh, uh, for, of mm -hmm. for for is that kind of a noodle mm -hmm. yeah uh, so good. well tell me are you a fussy eater fussy eater means it's you know a person who is really hard to please or choosy i don't like this food i don't like that food i don't try this i don't try that this is fussy eater it's really hard to please this guy this person uh. so are you a fussy eater <laughs> you know some people i don't think really... so i don't think so yeah, yeah. i don't think so but uh, i'll say i'm uh maybe the state the for the material is okay i yeah. can eat uh everything 
but uh, ingredients just, just ingredient, yeah, ingredients yes. of course yeah ingredient ingredients is okay i can eat uh yeah and it's yeah things. so but, uh the so you're not very concerned about smell or the look of food no you're not very concerned it's okay so if the ingredients <laughs> is okay so you can try <laughs> so, of course it's really good it's really good not to be uh, except <laughs> no no except exotic of course. Except, 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 insert, of uh, course of course well rock, rock. and the next <laughs> word do you have a sweet tooth it means when you have sweet tooth it means you like sweet taste you like uh, yeah sweet food sweet taste so do you have a sweet food yes of course of course, <laughs> yeah. I love uh sweet. I love sweet, and yeah. I love uh yes, cake, mm -hmm. cake, and uh, yes, everything sweet. Yeah. Yeah, of course. And the last one. So you can see I have a sweet food. That means I love sweet taste. Okay. And the last uh, word that is really important nowadays: processed foods are really common in societies among people. Especially young people, uh, of course, you know, tend to try processed food and use them because they're really easy and fast to, of course, to cook and to make because they're ready made. And they contain a lot of chemicals, you know, during actually the process of production or producing. And of course, maybe, maybe they're a little, I don't know, harmful. Just like you know, noodles, I don't know, a lot of ready-made food in supermarket. Of course, they are long-lasting. You can keep them oh. for a long time out of refrigerator. So this is processed food. We have tuna. We have, of course, you know, tuna. I don't know. We have some noodles, some ready-made foods. Okay, so what do you think about processed food? Do you normally use processed food or no? Uh, I totally... Uh, I I I don't like processed food. Basically, uh, for uh, instant noodle, I um, maybe uh, I'll say for instant noodle or uh, frozen food, yeah. right? I I I don't like. I I like. I prefer fresh, mm -hmm. fresh food, mm -hmm. and uh, yes, of course, of course. So, so why like why do you think people? Food? Why do you, uh, why do you think uh, people uh, try not to eat and not to use maybe homemade food and of course they rather processed food? Why do you think? Oh, maybe uh, they uh, they can uh, save time and money. Maybe <laughs> save time and money. Of yes, course, exactly. of course, yeah, of yeah. course, can be. Can be a good reason. More, you know, more time and less money, of course, because you need to, of course, spend money yeah. and buying processed food. So, yeah. of course. So, well, thank you. So, we learned some new words, right? So related to food. Okay. And now let's get started on book. Well, let me make it a little. Okay. So, yeah. Of course, this word is really familiar for you. Noodles, you know, and you have a lot of noodles and a different type of it. Okay, rice. Okay, do you like it? Do you normally eat yes, rice? Yes, of course, I love, yes, I love rice, yeah. Mm -hmm. So just, just pay attention. When I ask you, do you normally use, do you like, do you love? You can't say, yes, I love. You need to use auxiliary, yes, I do. So definitely, yes, I do. Yes, I do. Excellent. Yes, so anytime, yes, okay. if if any, maybe my question includes modal verb or auxiliary, it doesn't matter, present or past or future, you need to give a short answer, including auxiliary or modal verb. Okay? Okay. Yeah. Great. Very good. So vegetables. Okay. Do you uh, use a lot of vegetables per day and of course tell me do you have a healthy diet contain a lot of vegetables sorry once again yeah yeah 
uh, I'm asking you about vegetables. If you if you eat a lot of vegetables in you no, know, for example, per day, and if you have a healthy diet, including and in containing vegetables. Yes. 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 Yes, I, I think so. Yes. Ah, yes, yes I, I think do. so. Yes, yeah. I do. Okay. Yeah. So uh, tell me, is it essential to have vegetables in our diet, you think? Yes. Yes, I do. No. Yes, How I do you? know. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so let's talk about this. That is really important. So let me talk. Uh, oh. For example, you see, is it essential? So you need to pay attention how I make my question. My question, okay, is being made, including to be. Is it essential? So you answer, yes, it is. Do you yeah. like? Yes, I do. So it depends on the auxiliary the verb that I'm using to make my question, okay? Okay, yeah. Okay, well, so uh, vegetables, okay, and the next one, sandwich. Of course, so tell me, if you want to choose maybe some food, okay, for, for you, for yourself, of course, would you prefer vegetables, fast food, and junk food, or meat? <laughs> okay, <laughs> I, I prefer vegetable, okay. Yeah, well, really? Great. Yes, I don't <laughs> I, I don't like junk food and uh say I, I don't eat a lot of meat. Yeah. So maybe that's great. So you, I think yeah. you have a really healthy lifestyle. So that's really good, healthy habits. <laughs> yeah, of course, that is really good, you know, to have vegetables in our diet, especially when we eat them a lot. That's great. Well, yeah. The next one, yeah. Okay, you need to explain this to me. Hot pot, okay. Hot pot. Yeah, of course, you know this, you know? Yes, hot pot. So I explain. Uh, yeah, you this, have something uh, for, like for... this. You have something like this, yeah? Yes. It's a, you know, of course, it's a mixture of meat and maybe vegetables, potatoes, and of course, oh, they're yes. cooked slowly, you know, and yeah, this is hot pot. So do you have something like this? Uh, so for hot pot, mm -hmm. we uh, can uh, cook yeah. uh, vegetable, meat. Maybe pork or beef. Mm -hmm. Um, we cook with a boy. Mm -hmm. Water yeah. soup. Yeah, boy soup. Yes. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then maybe we we can eat with the sauce. Mm -hmm. Of course, you know we have something like this in a country. It's something like you know, uh, electrical equipment with uh something like small container to boil water, and of course we can cook something it in it slowly. So this is hot pot. Of course we use it. Yeah. Well, yeah, seafood. Tell me about. Okay, tell me about your favorite seafood. Seafood. Fish, shrimp. Ah, uh, yes. Fish, shrimp, snail. Yeah. Shell. Squid. Uh, yes. Shell. shell. Yeah. Uh, squid. Yeah. Uh, Which one is the best? Shrimp. <laughs> yes. Yeah. I like, <laughs> yeah, uh, I like shrimp and uh, squid. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Uh, what about crab? Crab. Ah, oh, yes, I also like crab. Like it? Yeah. But you know, it's, it's, it, it, take, 
it's hard to eat, right? You you have to. <laughs> of course, definitely yes. You know, once I I yeah. wanted to try it, but I couldn't. <laughs> I said, oh, it's yeah. it's really. Of course, it's really you know hard to eat it. Yeah. You need to have some appliances, some equipment to eat it. Yeah. Okay. Yes. Well, spring rolls. Okay, have you tried them? Spring rolls. Oh yes, them? of course. It's a Jap it's a Vietnamese food, so yeah, yeah really? it's very popular. Mm -hmm. Popular food. Yeah. yeah. How does it Spring taste? Rolls. Uh how does it taste? It's uh you know uh, we uh wrap meat mm -hmm. and say like pork shrimp and uh, some uh vegetable mm -hmm. and uh, we uh Cook it by oil. Yeah, I got it. Yeah, so yeah, got it. Mm. So it, good. Sh it should be delicious. Yes, yes it's good. Yeah. I think. Yeah, yeah. I'd say so. I need to try it. Okay, salad. Okay, do you normally eat a lot of salad? Uh, maybe in yes. meals, of course, and maybe dinner or with your lunch or dinner. Yes. Do you eat? Do okay, oh, so yes. yeah. Do you eat salad as a main dish or side dish? Uh, which one? Oh, I eat the uh, salad as a side mm -hmm. dish. It's side not. Dish. It's not. Uh, it's not become mm -hmm. a main dish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And tell me about your country. Uh, you know, people in your country. Do people in your country? Eat salad with food, or no? It's something you know. Maybe it's not really common. Oh yes, in uh, Vietnam, uh, we eat a lot of salad. Especially mm -hmm. uh, Vietnamese love uh, mm -hmm. raw mm -hmm. vegetable, mm -hmm. love raw vegetable. Raw so, vegetables, uh, yeah. Yes, yeah, we eat a lot of uh, salad. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Okay. Oh. Ah, today's lesson is really delicious, you know? <laughs> okay. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love. I love yeah, pizza. I love. Of course. I love, uh, I love uh, Italian food. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's really uh, delicious, but burning calories is, God, it's really hard. So I prefer not to eat it. <laughs> okay oh, really? <laughs> so, really it's really hard to burn the calories because i think you know Calorie. one pizza has uh i think 800 calories and that is really literally you know it's it's really high calories yeah. so it's really hard to burn yes. it so it's better not to eat it <laughs> yeah of course yeah. i can't i can't That's do good. a lot of activities to burn no. the, uh, these calories yeah so, I don't it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, okay. Let me close this. Well. well yeah. Beef steak. Mm, okay. Yeah. So tell beef me. Steak. Let's talk about meat. Of course, nowadays we have a lot of people who decided decided to be vegan, not to eat meat, and of course, meat product, maybe dairy product and meat. So, what do you think? You know, have you ever thought about being vegan? Vegan. Vegan. vegan, you know the people, the people vegan. who only eat vegetables. Vegan, vegetarian. Ah, uh, yes. Ah, mm. uh, vegetarian, vegan, vegan. Vegan, yeah, I wrote here, vegan. Yeah, actually, um, I'll say for for my case, I, I love uh, vegetable. But uh, I also uh, love fish and uh, meat. I, I don't eat a lot of meat, but I eat a lot of fish. So, um, I say for actually for a long time, I, I ate a lot of uh, vegetables I, and I didn't eat fish and meat, but uh, I, I want to eat. I'll say your maybe your body mm -hmm. is uh mm -hmm. 
your your body need fish or meat. So yes. for my case, it's the mm -hmm. mm, yes. Okay, vegan, ah, vegan. Yeah, of course, of course. It's not yes. It's not. We, yeah. we need we need the uh, mm -hmm. meat and fish. I think. So, uh, tell me, of course, yeah. uh, some people, uh, you know, have bias against the other people. For example, if I am vegan, okay, I have bias against the other people who eat meat. They say, no, you don't do it. Of course, it's not good. Okay, do you think, do you think we need to be broad-minded? It means we need to respect others' opinions and beliefs. Okay, or no, you think if we decided to be, for example, vegan, we need to force the other people to follow us, you know, so what do you think? Uh, oh, no, I don't think so. I don't think so. It's just, just your uh, lifestyle, right? People love meat or fish or mm -hmm. vegetable and uh, you you do what you do, uh, what you want mm -hmm. to do. It's, Yes, uh, I I don't think so. Yes, if you uh, love vegetable, you you can do it. <laughs> so so so, are you broad minded? Broad mind. No, broad minded. It means uh, you know. Do you respect others' opinions or beliefs? It means you are free thinking. Oh yes, ah oh, yes, free thinking. Yeah, it's uh, yeah, yeah. So good. Okay. So, so yes, you are. Of course, yeah. you try to be. Well, okay. okay. Now let's talk about, you know, different tastes. Okay, tell me the best taste: sweet, sour, salty, bitter. Which one? The best taste. Sweet. Sweet. Yeah. Yeah. The worst taste. <laughs> okay, now tell me the worst taste. Worst taste. Hmm. Bitter or salty. Bitter. Yeah. Bitter. Right. Yeah. I'm really <laughs> I'm a big fan of salty food. <laughs> God. Oh really? Yeah. yeah. Of course. You know, I'm not of course I'm not a big fan of sweet taste. You know, I you know I normally Good don't taste. eat chocolate candies, but about salty, you know, oh god, I really like it. So well, <laughs> so we have sweet, we have sweet salty. taste. Of course, we have salty, we have spicy. Yeah, tell me, uh, do you normally eat spicy food in Vietnam? Yes, we have some uh, some kind of uh, spicy food. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, so some some people mm -hmm. like spicy food. Yeah. Yeah, uh, and how about you? Do you like? No, I I cannot. I, I can't. I yeah. Can't. No, I don't. Yeah. Do you like? No, I don't. I don't. I don't. Okay, yeah. attention no, I don't. to my auxiliary. That is really important. No, I don't. Okay. No, I don't. For, for example, I say, can you eat? You say, no, I can't. No, I but can't. You, yeah, okay. because I asked you with can. Now I ask you with do. So you answer with do. Okay. Sour. Sour. Yeah. Hmm. So tell me, uh, do you normally, do you have, I don't know, uh, food with sour taste? Do you eat or do you like in Vietnam? Uh, yes, in uh, Vietnam, we have some uh, kind of soup. And it's, uh, it's a bit sour, mm -hmm. a bit sour. I think it's very... Uh, quite different with uh mm -hmm. so, so far i i eat the uh, italian food yeah. japanese food chinese food and uh, yeah. i i don't for other country i i don't yeah. think uh, they have a uh, sour soup yeah. no, no but we don't Vietnam, ah, maybe thai yeah. thailand in thailand we have thailand uh, uh, it's a bit sour right and uh, we use the uh, some uh, fruit some sour fruit yeah we put we put to the soup and it's a bit sour yeah i got it yeah i got it so. mon, mon, 
Oh yes, some yes, some some kind of a fruit. Yeah, yeah. interesting. Well, okay, plant. Name a bland food. Bland means not sour, not oh. salty, oh. not sweet, nothing. So <laughs> name <laughs> name a bland food. Bland. Bland. Ah, yes. Of course, lettuce, I for example. I... Lettuce is bland. You know, no taste. It has no taste. And so I think lettuce no is taste. bland. Yes. Yeah. So what do you think? Bland. Bland. Uh, how say? Oh, Vietnamese food is a bit, uh, we use a lot of oil and uh, it's a bit uh, salty. But mm -hmm. uh, for Japanese food, basically, it's a bit uh, bland. Yeah. For Japanese food. Yeah. Because it's like uh, the ingredient, ingredient mm -hmm. is a very fresh. So uh -huh. uh, they want, if you enjoy the ingredient, yeah, so I they don't it. put a lot of oil or yeah. salt. Yes, season. Yeah, they first. don't use a lot of uh, seasoning, right? Yeah, of course. So the more healthy, the less tasty. You know, of course. That's right. If right. it's yeah, of course. Yes, if right. it's healthy, it you know it shouldn't be tasty. It should be bland, of course. Bland. So, yes. Yeah. Maybe it's good for your health, but of uh, course, definitely. <laughs> sometimes yes. it's not. Yes, you you uh, yes, the test is not good. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> sometimes. Of course. Yeah. Yeah, of course. Well, so we have some, of course, words here. You can see the words and phrases. And of course, you know them. I'm not going to talk about them again because maybe it's a little boring to talk about them again. Well, okay, let's keep going. Just pay attention. You know, as you can see, taste or adjectives, a salty, spicy oh, sour and bland or adjective but about the other words that we'll learn for example seafood hot pot vegetables your nouns okay so just pay attention to the difference between these two and now uh let's take a look at this word uh i don't know maybe i told you before about be, uh, be going to and i want to how to pronounce okay for example we pronounce i wanna go we don't say i want to I wanna go. I wanna do. Or I wanna I'm go. yeah. Or I'm gonna go. So let me write here for be going to. What is this? Okay, for be going to say for example. I'm going to go. We say. Uh, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna I'm go. I'm gonna go. Okay, yeah. I'm gonna or, go. I want to go, I want to go. We don't say I want to go, we say I want to go. So go. something that okay. yeah. And as you know, after want, we use to and verb.